<clears throat> ah. <clears throat> ah. 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 Man, oh man. What's good, y'all? Welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. Ah. Looks like December is coming to a close in two days. Um, today is the 30th. It is Sunday. So you know what that means, man. Hey, just got done watching the, um, the Patriots play uh, against the, the terrible ass Jets. Um, I'd hate to say I told y'all so. You know what I'm saying? But hey, I told you so. You know what I'm saying? Came into came into um New England once again, you know what I'm saying, having home field. And we took care of business today. I have absolutely nothing negative to say about the way that the Patriots played today. Offense was absolutely amazing. You know what I'm saying? Um, we didn't have Cordell Patterson today. Um, McCourty, Devin McCourty went down with a couple injuries. Um, not even a couple injuries. Um, shit, a fucking concussion. Um, which was basically the only negative negatives that I took away from the game. Um, but that's fine. You know what I'm saying? Um, we happen to win the game. So that means now, you know what I'm saying, regular season is over for us. Now we get ready for the playoffs. Um, Playoff-wise, when looking at the playoffs, we have a first-round bye. So we don't have to worry about playing in the wild card. That all also means that, um, you know what I'm saying, with, with the bye week happening, Everyone has a chance to get healthy, and then next week, you know what I'm saying, we just have to worry about whoever we play, you know what I'm saying, when it comes down to, you know what I'm saying, the teams we play, I don't really care, you know what I'm saying, like, it's not me being cocky, you know what I'm saying, I'm not, I'm not cocky, I'm just confident in this team, and, um, fuck was that um it's not me me being cocky it's me being confident in this team and after watching them play these last two weeks i'm gonna say it, if we can play that way um especially the way that we play today you know what i'm saying um then we should have no problem beating whoever we have to play i don't care if it's the Chargers. i don't care if it's the goddamn ravens the colts the titans i don't care if we play you know what I'm saying? I'm confident enough in Tom Brady and this team, offense and defensively, to, to win games. You know what I'm saying? In the playoffs. And we've done that with less players than we have right now. Do you know what I'm saying? Uh, defense today was absolutely amazing. You know what I'm saying? I think we had four turnovers. Four first four forced turnovers. Um we had a couple couple um fumbles, you know what I'm saying? Um that we forced. One was a, a fumble recovery for a touchdown. But, you know what I'm saying? Shout out Kyle Van Noy. Um, Yeah, man. Defensively, we showed up. Uh, Tom Brady also, you know what I'm saying? Offensively, went the fuck off. Uh, shout out to Philip Dorsett. Shout out to Julian Edelman. Shout out to Gronkowski. Uh, that offensive line held up as well. So, shout out to them. You know what I'm saying? I was thoroughly impressed with how we played today. And, yeah. You know, um, like I said, I have no problem with who whoever we play. You know what I'm saying? Regardless, I'm gonna give all the all the luck in the world to them. You know what I'm saying? Um, 
Because whatever team we play against, they're going to need the luck. You know what I'm saying? I have no question in my mind that Tom Brady will go off in the playoffs and do what Tom Brady has done throughout his entire career, and that is show up in big games um, and win games when it matters and come through in the clutch um, in big game situations. So with that being said, I really, like I said, I don't got nothing negative to say about this, this game or these last couple weeks. Because I feel like these these last couple of weeks have probably been the one some of the best best some of the best basketball um, some of the best football that we've played this season um, both offensively and defensively like I said also the play calling was fantastic today shout out to Josh McDaniels um, our running game you know what I'm saying has picked up you know what I'm saying um, we haven't been a running game type of team you know what I'm saying we don't really re we haven't really relied on the run um, in previous years but I feel like with the running running backs we have now it's like starting to pick up so instead of having to always rely on the pass we can sometimes rely on running backs to, to get us you know what I'm saying the yards necessary for us to win games and make plays you know what I'm saying like shout out to James White uh, this season has had one of the best seasons um, of his career you know what I'm saying seven receiving touchdowns um, obviously had a, had a decent running running um, season. Um, also, Sonny Michelle, one of my favorite rookies um, on this team besides J.C. Jackson. Um, amazing season so far. Um, and we'll see what they do in the, in the playoffs. Obviously, James White is probably going to most likely go off, so that, that'll be exciting to see. Um, and, yeah, I think... I think that's gonna be it, basically. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, nothing really negative to say. If if we had lost this game, then I'd probably be losing my shit. But you know what I'm saying? Um, when looking looking back at the regular season, all I gotta say is we made the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? And if if we make the playoffs any season, then I feel like we accomplished something. Perfect. You know what I'm saying? As a fan, I can't complain. As long as we make the playoffs, I have nothing to complain about. You know what I'm saying? How far are we going to playoffs? That's yet to be seen. You know what I'm saying? We'll have to wait a week to see how we play in the playoffs. Um, and like I said, with Tom Brady as our quarterback and Bill Belichick as a coach, um, and seeing how they've been, you know what I'm saying, able to handle playoff, you know what I'm saying, environments, regardless of who we play against, I'm confident in the, in the team. You know what I'm saying? Yes, we've been we struggled um, defensively this season, but over these last couple weeks, we picked it up when needed. So, with that being said, shout out to this defense, man. Um, can't wait for the playoffs to start. It's about to be lit. Um, it's been a successful season. It's kind of it's been a been a rough start. It was a rough start to the season. Uh, obviously, we wish we had Josh Gordon at this point still hope I hope that man you know what I'm saying is doing well um, wish him all the best in um, in the future and everything um, you know what I'm saying obviously he was a huge impact on this team had a huge impact on this team um, offensively gonna miss his presence in the playoffs um, that's okay you know what I'm saying we've we've won Super Bowls without him and it ain't gonna be no different you know what I'm saying going to the playoffs without him is, is no different than the five seasons that we've went to the playoffs and we've, you know what I'm saying, done things that, that no other team has been able to do, you know. Uh, but it's been an incredible season, regardless of how many losses we've had, you know what I'm saying? It's just five losses. Niggas want, people want to um, doubt us because we've had five five losses on the season and that's not really such a uh, patriot, patriot-like thing to do uh, because they're so accustomed to us having great seasons and only losing around like three games in the season. Um, but it's just fucking football, you know what I'm saying? Things happen, not going to win them all. Am I going to sit here and complain because we lost five games in the season? No. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to look at the 11 games we won this year, and I'm going to be happy with it because we made the playoffs on like certain teams in the league, you know what I'm saying? Certain fans don't get to, you know what I'm saying, wake up next week and watch a football game and, and cheer on for their team, you know what I'm saying, and hope that their team gets to go further down in the playoffs. No, they're – they're the type of fans, their team is out. You know what I'm saying? If you're a Raider fan, you don't care about the season. Jets, 
trash. The Giants, trash. You know what I'm saying? If y'all team didn't make the playoffs this year, I feel bad for you. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, y'all y'all prob probably don't freaking care about <clears throat> Y'all probably don't care about the Patriots making the playoffs because y'all probably hate the Patriots, but I don't. You know what I'm saying? Uh, once again, no, I'm not a fucking bandwagon, so don't come for me talking about I'm a bandwagon. No, I'm not. I've been supporting this team my whole life. Uh, it's not going to stop. Got a motherfucking slim gym. Go ahead, eat this motherfucking Slim Jim. And um, I'm gonna end the video right there, y'all. Smash the motherfucking like button if you enjoyed this video. Um, hit that motherfucking subscribe button as well if you ain't subscribed to the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And um, turn on them motherfucking goddamn post notifications by hitting that black bell. Um, and leave a goddamn comment in the, in the comments section down below. Let me know what other videos y'all want me to post more of. Um, like I said, December is over tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? It's New Year's Eve tomorrow. Um, 2019 is about to be a lit year. You know what I'm saying? A whole lot of new new content and new everything is going to happen to this channel. So be prepared for that. I will see y'all in tomorrow's video. I love y'all to death. Thank y'all for watching this video. I'm going to just go ahead and eat this Slim Jim. I really, I'm so glad that did not just freaking happen. Um, but I will see y'all in tomorrow's video, man. Thank y'all for watching. Take it easy. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. I'm out of here. Love y'all. Uh.